Hello everyone. Welcome back to our channel. Today we are talking about the hearing test and exploring what specific tests are conducted for individuals of all ages from adults to newborn babies. Let's start with the hearing test tailored for adults. Adults usually go through a number of tests meant to check different areas of their hearing health. These tests are very important for figuring out how sensitive their hearing is and how well their hearing is in general. Pure tone audiometry is one of the main tests that is done on adults to check their hearing. For this test, the person has to put on headphones and listen to tones with different frequencies and volumes. Audiologists can correctly figure out a person's ability to hear sounds across the hearing range by closely watching how they react. Speech audiometry is an important part of testing adults' hearing. This test is mostly about how well the person can understand and tell the difference between different kinds of speech in different hearing situations. Audiologists can test a person's ability to understand spoken language by playing different levels of recorded or live speech. Also, tympanometry is a very important way to check how well an adult's middle ear is working. To do this non-invasive test, the eardrums, movement in reaction to changes in air pressure is measured. This gives important information about the health and function of the middle ear. Lastly, autoacoustic emissions OAE. Researchers often used to find problems in adults' inner ears. This test checks to see if the inner ear is working in reaction to outside stimulation. Audiologists can find possible problems in the cochlea, which helps them diagnose a number of hearing diseases. Coming to children, it is very important to take care of their hearing because it is a big part of their general health and growth. Like adults, children go through a variety of hearing tests that are meant to give a full picture of how well their hearing works. A basic part of hearing tests is pure tone audiometry, which is used to check how sensitive children's hearing is to different frequencies. Audiologists can find areas of hearing loss or disability by playing different tones for the person. Speech audiometry is another important part of pediatric hearing tests that checks how well kids can understand and tell the difference between sounds. This test is very important because understanding what people say is important for connection and language growth. Tympanometry is used to check how well a child's middle ear is working. It can show problems like fluid buildup or problems with the eardrum. This test helps audiologists find problems in the hearing. In some cases, autoacoustic emission tests may be done on children to find problems with their inner ears. This non-invasive test measures the sounds that the inner ear makes and respond to outside stimuli. This helps find cochlear failure or other problems with the inner ear early. Children needs to have a regular hearing test because Early identification and treatment can have big effect on their growth. Now let's shift our focus to newborn babies. They get special hearing tests soon after they are born. These tests, which are also called the autoacoustic emissions OAE test or the auditory brainstem response ABR test, are carefully created to find out how the baby reacts to sounds. The OAE test picks up on the tiny sounds that the inner ear makes in response to sound outside the ear. Audiologists can test the cochlear function by measuring these sounds which gives them important information about the baby's hearing. In the same way, the ABR test checks the electrical activity that the auditory nerve and brainstem produce when sound is present. 
This test tracks how the brain reacts to sounds, which tells us more about the baby's hearing route and any possible hearing problems. These screening tests are very helpful for finding hearing problems in newborns. Early discovery lets help and action happen quickly, making sure that the right steps can be taken to effectively handle any hearing problems. Early detection is especially important for babies because hearing is a basic part of many developmental processes. Hearing is an important part of a newborn's general health and mental development. So whether you're an adult, child or a newborn baby, there are specific hearing tests tailored to assess your auditory well-being. Don't hesitate to prioritize your auditory health and schedule regular hearing assessments for yourself and your loved ones. Your hearing is precious and taking proactive steps to protect it is essential for your overall well-being and quality of life. Thanks for watching. If you found this video helpful, please like, share and subscribe to the Hears App channel for more health tips. Remember, early detection of hearing loss can greatly improve quality of life. Take care and stay healthy.